What? This is crazy. Oh my goodness. It could do this too. Oh, Y'all, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kadisha. And if you're new here, don't forget to smash that subscribe button and to click the bell so that you can be notified when your girl uploads a new video. And guys, like, please subscribe and help us sister get to a thousand subscribers. Okay, please. Like, please. Okay, so now that we're done with the begging, <laughs> let's get into the video. All right, so in today's video, I will be unboxing, as you can see from the title, my new ring light, and it's from L8 Star. And at the end, I'm going to tell y'all what I think, if I thought it was worth the purchase. So if y'all want to see that unboxing, in my opinion, on this, keep on watching, y'all. So inside that really big box were two other boxes, one that, you know, obviously had the shape of the ring light and whatever. And of course, like it's really obvious, the other box has to be a tripod, right? Because like, it's just obvious. <laughs> So right here we have the control so that's what you use to like turn it on turn it off to switch between the different modes to dim the light or to you know make it bright and stuff like that and also at the end you had um a usb connection right maybe i'll tell you a little story about that later <laughs>
to be honest with you guys, I did not read the remote manual. It was pretty self-explanatory. I mean, I got it right from the get-go. Um, this one, though, the ring light. Um, I had some difficulty with the ring light, and this manual was not mm. helpful. Um, so definitely, I don't side to this. So I will go ahead and say that I thought this was very nicely packaged and I also thought that the you know the carrying bag was made of very nice material you know it felt like quality stuff So this right here is the second tripod that came with this. This one is the one that, you know, you'd put on the ground and, you know, you can adjust the height and stuff like that. No, the feel of this was simply amazing. Like it felt sturdy. It felt like real quality. And to be honest, I was really impressed with that quality stuff, guys. So one of the reasons for purchasing this particular model was um, because I got two tripods. I got one where I could put on like a table so when I'm shooting my food videos and I wanted like an additional source of light that it could really provide me with that. And also like if I wanted to do a face-to-face -face video I could have that as well with the other tripod. So for me I just really liked having two tripod options. All right, guys, so quick story time. I know y'all are like, so where did this come from? This adapter did not come in the box itself. I actually had to purchase this in order to like plug the USB aspect of this ring light in it so that it could actually work. Now, personally, I think if y'all are going to make something, like at least put the attachment in the box. Like, I think not everybody has a five volt adapter at home sitting around so i was really disappointed about that because i had to actually go out and purchase one so yeah that's like no i was no i was not happy about that at all okay so at this point i'm just gonna turn it on and try it out so of course this is an 11 inch dimmable ring light by L8 Star just in case y'all didn't get that from the jump right so I'm just switching between the different modes there are three modes on the here and I'm just switching between those and of course you can also increase the intensity and decrease it as well all right I think it goes up to like 10 different levels or something of the sort but yeah Alright, so at this point I'm going to try it with the other tripod and in order to adjust it, you just flip those red things. Once you flip them up, it will become loose and you can basically adjust it to whatever height you want. Now, once you do that for all three, then you're basically good to go in getting it to stand up and all that jazz. I will go ahead and say that I thought the ring light itself was, you know, 
easy to figure out because like i said guys i i, I tried reading the manual but it really wasn't doing it for me it wasn't cutting it so you know i had to just play around with it and figure out some of it out on my own and the rest i went back to amazon to actually look at the product itself and it kind of helped me out but yeah it wasn't too bad in terms of like navigating it and trying to figure it out so that was good okay so i'm putting this on try not to make the same mistake that i did i was twisting it around but that was totally wrong all i needed to do was just to attach the ring light to the tripod and then tighten that little red knob that's directly underneath it i'm doing it right now that's all i needed to do just tighten that and you'll be good to go So this is where this ring light shines y'all in terms of how well this is, was built like the design of this tripod is simply amazing and I think you guys will see that so this one of the reasons why I got this particular model was because I wanted something that could give me 360 degrees um, in terms of you know flexibility and I definitely got that with this but I got so much more as well and you'll see all of that so when shooting my cooking videos or taking pictures of stuff, you know, I want to have that full 360. I want to be like directly over my food shots and stuff. And this gave me that flexibility and I absolutely loved it. So as y'all can clearly see, I was definitely shook by everything that just happened. I was absolutely mind blown. And once you tighten that knob right there, like it's not going anywhere. It's so sturdy. It feels really, really good.
this point, I think the really big question is, is it worth it? Hmm. So despite the poor user manual having to spend more money on an adapter and, you know, the broken Bluetooth remote, I still thought this was a worthwhile purchase because at the end of the day, guys, I only spent $36.99 on this ring light. So all the aforementioned problems, I can actually, you know, work around and try to fix them, you know, find creative ways to make do with the product. I mean, overall, it works and it does what I want it to do for the most part. So yeah, definitely a worthwhile purchase. So if y'all enjoyed that video, don't forget to hit the like. Don't forget to leave a comment as to whether or not you thought this was a worthwhile purchase. Would you purchase this one? And if not, which brand did you buy? And why did you like that brand? And also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, guys. Like, help us sister out, okay? And also, you can go ahead and watch this video that's popping up right over here. Thank you so much for watching to the end. See you in the next one, guys. As always, at the corner of happy and healthy is where you want to be. Bye!